In this video we will talk very briefly about the evolution of the foundations of mathematics. We will also stress the fact that the foundations, in themselves, have become a field of research within the science of mathematics. Finally, we'll present a proposed division for the science of mathematics. Let's begin. For more than 2,000 years, the axioms of Euclidean geometry served as the foundation for the development of mathematics. However, a series of discoveries during the 17th, 18th, and 19th centuries led to question the solidity of these foundations, and as a consequence to the crisis they suffered at the beginning of the 20th century. Among the most important of these discoveries, we can mention the introduction of the analytic geometry by René Descartes in the 17th century. The discovery of calculus by Isaac Newton and Gottfried Leibniz, also in the 17th century. Advances in the formalization of the fundamental concepts of calculus during the 18th and 19th centuries by Bernhard Boltzano, Augustin Louis Cauchy, Bernhard Riemann, Karl Weierstrass, and Richard Dedekind. The discovery of the non-Euclidean geometries in the 18th and early 19th centuries by Nikolai Lobachevsky, Janosz Polyai, and Karl Friedrich Gauss, among others. The introduction of the Boolean algebra by George Boole in the 19th century. The development of mathematical logic, also during the 19th century, by George Boole, Gottlob Frege, Giuseppe Piano, Bertrand Russell, Alfred Whitehead, David Hilbert, and Kurt Gödel among many others. The development of the elementary, naive, set theory by George Cantor, at the end of the 19th century. The discovery of paradoxes in Cantor's set theory, by Bertrand Russell and others, at the beginning of the 20th century. And the attempts to overcome these paradoxes in the development of axiomatic set theories by Ernst Zermelo, Adolf Frankel, John von Neumann, Paul Bernays, Kurt Gödel, and others during the 20th century. Since mid-20th century into the present day, early 21st century, the aforementioned discoveries have completely changed our vision about mathematics, and have led to consider the foundations of mathematics as a field of research in themselves. A more or less acceptable division of the science of mathematics includes these seven major areas, which could be further divided as follows. Foundations of mathematics, including, mathematical logic, set theory, and category theory. Number theory, including, algebraic number theory, analytic number theory, arithmetic, and numbers. Discrete mathematics, including, combinatorics, graph theory, and order theory. Algebra, including, elementary algebra, abstract algebra, geometric algebra, linear algebra, and universal algebra. Analysis, including, calculus, measure theory, real analysis, complex analysis, differential equations, integral equations, approximation theory, special functions, potential theory, harmonic analysis, functional analysis, and operator analysis. Geometry and topology, including, Euclidean geometry, non-Euclidean geometry, affine geometry, projective geometry, convex geometry, discrete geometry, algebraic geometry, differential geometry, and topology. Applied mathematics, including, mathematical modeling, mathematical physics, dynamical systems, optimization, mathematical economics, statistics, probability, numerical analysis, theoretical computer science, cryptography, and information theory. 